Hey guys, it's Sam and I have been wanting to film a video. I actually filmed a grocery haul earlier today, but I used my uh, Canon camera and it just, when I try to upload it to the computer, it wouldn't. And then if I transfer it to my phone, it would take forever. So I'm just going to film it on my phone because I know that that works and hopefully this will be uploaded sometime this week. Okay, so it's going to be a haul. I've collected so many things and it's just sitting on my floor taking up a lot of space. It's already a tiny room to begin with. And the first thing is I'm going to... Oh, okay. How am I going to do this? Well, I got a new phone. It's still the Samsung. And funny story, I actually was able to upgrade, but I was like, you know what? I want to switch it up and I want to get an iPhone. And the iPhone was so pretty. It was it was beautiful. But I could not. I've been on Android now for well over 10 years. And don't want to age myself. But I kind of felt that way. Like I'm like I don't understand how to use this phone. And I tried for, for a few days. And it just wasn't fun. When you get like a new toy you want to play with it and it's fun to learn the new things for, about your phone but this was just not working for me so I returned it and I got the the Samsung S21 and I love it the camera is really really good it takes great pictures videos hopefully are good you guys let me know and of course with that comes with uh, I got a new case it's the clear one that's on the phone right now and then another kind of techie thing that I've, I've always wanted was a ring light and you kind of see it if I turn this you can see it in the mirror behind me there it goes <laughs> uh, so I got a ring light and it is the looking at the box I have it right here the Taltronics Taltronics LED stand light and it comes with the stand uh, the ring light you are able to change the colors so let me just do that so you can see. So that's changing it. Um, I think it does 10 settings. It has 10 settings. And then this one is, that's low. I think I like, not this one. It's a little too hospital looking, but this one is good. So you let me know if you like that or not. And it was on sale. Uh, so that's why I picked it up and I'm really liking it. I think it looks, it makes making me look a little bit brighter and you could see things better. Uh, next thing is uh, kind of uh, like my, I work at a school and it's kind of like school merch. I'm not going to show you the bottom because that's the name of the school, but this is rainbow. This is a t-shirt for the rainbow club. And this is a design that the social worker made. It's super cute. And I wanted to, uh, donate not it's not it wasn't a donation uh, I wanted to be part of a good cause and this is super cute so I'm glad to have received that I'll wear that one day next week I think and then oh another piece of clothing is from Costco I think I have a Costco addiction I can't leave that store without spending tons of money and it's not good so we actually only go there once a month last month i think we did go twice um but we try to keep it once a month because if we go more than that we'll we'll be bankrupt uh but they had these joggers that's a great picture of it <laughs> instead of me holding it up all awkwardly and i got this kind of it's called olive uh, the color and a size medium. It seemed like the medium was pretty big. So hopefully these will keep me cool as they say or even fit. I didn't try it on yet. Uh, but that's 32 cool. Sorry, I feel like I'm all over the place. I'll try to stay more on track. Uh, next is Old Navy. You guys know that's my store. Uh, I got this striped shirt. I don't have any striped shirts like this, so I always used to listen to that, you know, that phrase of 
bigger people shouldn't wear stripes or stripes make you look bigger uh, but I don't know I thought under a hoodie or a cardigan or something that would look cute then for International Women's Day they have this really bright and festive shirt so I picked this up that I th thought I could wear that for International Women's Day which is March 8th This came in a set, but I um, gave one to my sister already. It was a gray one, and it was more of a turban style headband. This one is just the the bow, and it looks super cute. I'm not gonna try it on because not that my hair's done, but it'll make a mess. And then I got these pair of jeans. I feel like they're new. They're called the Rockstar Super Skinny Extra High Rise. Um, and I love this color blue for jeans. Could kind of like make it look fancy if you wanted to because they're so dark. Very comfortable. They are super high waisted, which I love. And the only thing is, I couldn't get petite, so there is a little bit of length at the bottom, but not too much that I would return them. So, love these. And then, oh, from Costco again. Now we're, I think the clothing part of this haul is done. I think it's something from Costco's, uh, Costco and fish oil. I'm going to try using that. It was actually for Steve, but he didn't want that kind. But I'm going to keep it. And then zinc. I swear by zinc. I have been using zinc for the past several years. Uh, I started it pre-pandemic but it's obviously helps me out during the pandemic as well um, it just for, it helps your immune system I feel like because of this when I was in school um, it really just helped me say say healthy and not get sick or anything like that so highly recommend and of course you get it at Costco so you get a year supply at least and what shall we do next? Oh, uh, very important. Girl Scout cookies. I I didn't know where I was going to order. Usually if I'm in school, uh, you know, several people have um, are selling Girl Scout cookies and it was easy to buy it that way. But this year, since we've been home, or I've been home, <laughs> I've been home, it's been kind of, it's harder to order cookies. But there was... A thing going around did I see it on Instagram first or the news but uh, troop I think 6,000 or 7,000 I forgot the name um, I we bought we bought through them it just helps support homeless girls in the city and I thought that was just an awesome way to buy Girl Scout cookies my favorites are the Samoas and I want to try the trifles I love uh, shortbread and then the other one that we finished was the s'mores, but I didn't love that one. Um, I'm not sure if it was too sweet. Well, all these are sweet, but I, I don't know. I just wasn't in love with it. It was good, but I wasn't in love with it. And next we have, let's see here. My sister got me a couple of gifts. One is this nail polish. I could, was it for Valentine's Day? I like to give little things for Valentine's Day. You'll see later a couple of things for Easter. Uh, she got me this washi tape, which I think has makeup stuff on it. It is so cute. And then this nail polish, uh, gel nail polish, and it is the color Dagon Days. I'm not sure, but I it's this. It's an opal. It's hard to tell. But I can't wait to try this. I've been doing my nails a lot recently. And to go with that, she also got me. I've been testing out from Amazon or ordering and returning because they just haven't worked out gel nail polishes. She got me this brand to try. It's Joy Tea. And you get, they're small, but I feel like I don't use gel nail polish up that much. Uh, so these are the colors. And I wanted specifically this color, the neon with kind of yellow highlighter color. Excited to try those. 
And then of course, high chews. They're so good. And she doesn't use her Clarisonic, so she gave me her old one. And I have one too, but I feel like hers is newer because she rarely used it. I'll save the kind of like beauty stuff for the end. And not only, I didn't just get one, there's this hand wipes. And then there's, are these hand wipes? And I like these so much better. I mean, I have a bunch of the the liquid kind or the gel kind, uh, but the wipes are just so much easier to use and I feel like they're a little bit more multi-purpose. And let's see. Um, Wegmans, I got this IGK Crybaby. It's an anti-frizz uh, smoothing serum and I know you look at me and you're like you have straight hair what is your problem but it does get frizzy I don't know what it is and I think it's because I have a lot of hair maybe that's why uh, and I love this packaging love it um, at Target I got a couple more nasal sprays this just my nose is gets so stuffy all the time. There's always stuff in it. Sorry, TMI, but it's true. Um, I'm allergic to a bunch of stuff in the air, and this helps me. I do, I do it in the shower. And for Easter, <laughs> I decided to get this from Target, um, and it does... Oh, wait. Why can't I get it? It does light up. Uh, you can move the ears if you wanted to. I just thought that was cute. And plus, I could use this for school as well or costumes. And that way I don't feel bad for spending five bucks on a bunny headband. Uh, for Easter, I got, I'm going to give my family, there's the Kinder Joy. Cookies and cream. Uh, peeps. And this one is... It's dipped in milk chocolate. They had Target had a whole bunch of like different kinds, which was, was cool. And then this one is for my grandmother. Dove chocolate. I couldn't find it's so hard. I wish they would uh and not just Target but all stores. I wish they would focus a little section on sugar free that's also decorative. I know if I go to the regular candy aisle, uh they'll have some sugar free options, but I wish that they would do it for for um, Easter, Valentine's Day, stuff like that, where you would buy chocolate for people. So that's for Easter. I like to plan ahead. <laughs> and then we're getting to the last few things here. Uh, my teacher, uh, she, she had gotten me, I'm a little embarrassed, I always do stuff like that. Uh, she had gotten me a Golden Girls puzzle, but I already have a couple and I went to return it, but the way she had, so she had paid through PayPal and when I returned it, the girl put it back to, or the cashier put it back to her PayPal and I was like so embarrassed because I didn't tell her that I was going to return it. So I had texted her and was like, I'm sorry, I returned it. Um, and she was like, she never responded, and I'm sorry, I keep on spitting at the camera. Gross. Uh, she never had responded, and I was like freaking out. I thought she was upset, but she wasn't. And she actually had sent me this happy box, and I love subscription boxes. It doesn't matter what it is. And this one is so cute. Uh, she said, here's a little something to celebrate since your holiday gift didn't work out. And I thought this was just so sweet. Um, next time, though, if you ever do this, read the fine print of how the money's going back, just so you're not embarrassed. Uh, there was a Golden Girl sticker that I put on my laptop right away. Uh, here's a face mask. This one is lavender. Uh, then there was a little honey bear and tea. Big Hearts Tea, Cup of Love, uh, Herbal Tea, and I thought this was a really sweet gift and I really appreciate that she um, took my return in stride. Um, and, and speaking of 
work related stuff my schedule is changing I'm still remote uh, but there I think I'm gonna be working with a child I work in pre-k but I think I'm gonna be working also with a child one child in second grade so I'm not sure it's already like March I'm hoping that we're a good fit and I'm nervous it's like I don't know anything about this child and uh, we're still working out the schedule so who knows what's gonna be happening with that um, but yeah that's something that's changing in my life and let's continue on with the haul we're almost done I pick I haven't gotten I have gotten like skincare stuff but I haven't really gotten any makeup uh, so I picked up this is the elf poreless putty primer and I forgot who recommended it I'm always looking for a good primer I, I used this once but not enough to get back to you but I love the way it looks in there uh, so I'll have to play with that a few more times sorry the Clarisonic fell and then I think this is from my sister's, I got her the Look Fantastic box, and this might be from other beauty as well. Uh, so here is Lip Advocate by Floss. Looks like that. Love the packaging, pretty and pink. So it just gives you a hint of color. I like that. And then here's Christoph, Christoph Robin uh, Daily Hair Cream with Sandalwood. So it's a leave-in treatment. Love when I get free hair stuff. I don't think I've gotten a button. I don't think I've bought a hair product in a while. Except for the this one was recent. Then here is a more Pacific treatment cleansing foam. It will go into my travel bucket that I have. Oh, and I think that, that lip product smells good. Uh, Magnetone wipeout swipes, so makeup remover wipes. I'm very curious about this. You get two of these. Now I've tried the original beauty towel and I'm not in love with that, so. Hopefully this will work out better. Galactic lip gloss. Lid gloss. <laughs> Lid gloss. Oh my goodness. Look at this. So that looks really pretty. I don't know that much about it. Cream eyeshadow. Shimmer and shine stardust. It is really pretty. I can see like if you put it right in the center, but I haven't worn real makeup <laughs> in a very long time. And then the last thing from there is Illamasqua. Excited. The last thing I got from Illamasqua was I believe from Holt Look and that was a long time ago with uh, makeup brushes or nail polish. Look how pretty this is. It's so cute. I had to try that and is this you you will have to let me know is this like a primer or I don't know it looks like it would give your skin some shine uh, <laughs> a reindeer headband thing this is a, a gift for my sister this whole thing in here she got us gifts a while back uh, here is uh, like a tote little tote so cute oh my goodness I love the pom-poms today is actually parent-teacher conference but there's a little break in between um it's actually after three o'clock so we're not gonna have one until 6 p.m. so I have a bit of time uh, before that happens oh sh this pen rainbow pen so cute remember these this brings me back to childhood uh, here is um, eyelash helper contraption thing never had one always wanted one so I don't wear lashes I just that's a, something that I never have gotten into 
Uh, maybe I just haven't found the right pair. Travel disposable paper soap. So this is really cool. I feel like I've seen this now on Instagram as well. Uh, and it's paper. It's paper soap. I don't know how to use it. All the directions are in a different language, so we'll have to look that up. But super cool. This is also paper soap, I believe. That is so strange. I'm excited to try it. The Surmetic Deep Clear Bright Calming Oil Pad. Been really enjoying like face oils, face oils lately, so that sounds cool. And then these two products, I've had this brand before and I like it. This is the iUnique Centilla Calming Gel Cream. My face needs this a lot. It's so dry. I feel like it's a layer of like, you know, a snake or reptiles that shed their skin. It's I almost feel like um at that stage so dry and then uh aha <laughs> sorry aha no what is this i'm reading this <laughs> it just i was just, just gonna start to read all the letters but that's not no uh some by me toter <laughs> there you go um i haven't opened this so i'm not gonna show you and then the last thing is my friend from Target here. I don't know if any of you have noticed this, but I absolutely love this. When I saw it, I was like, oh my God. And I ran over to that section. So they had this one. They're planters, by the way, but I'm going to use this as a pencil holder or a pen, pen and pencil holder uh, on my desk because I just want to look at this. It is so funny to me. I just, I don't know. It's so cute. <laughs> I probably love it way too much than I should. Um, I got one for a sister as well. They had different colors. They had this one. They had a, kind of like a pink skin one. And then a darker color skin color. They had this one. A pink. And a brown. Uh, and then the last thing I'm going to share with you is something so funny to me. I don't know if any of you uh, caught this at Target in the garden section. Uh, and the last thing I'm going to share with you is something that is way too funny to me. It's, I don't know if all Targets are the same, but they're, they have, they always have this section in the back where um, they highlight uh, if it's like Super Bowl or uh, like spring is coming. So this was in the spring section and it's this little it's a planter i'm gonna be using it on my desk uh for pens and pencils things like that they had this one uh a pink one and a brown one uh, and they range from i think three sizes so this is the smallest they had a medium one and then they had a huge one and I think they're funny. I, if I had all the money, I would have gotten all of them because they were just too funny. Look at this. I don't know. I just found it very interesting. And do you see the cheeks? Even the cheeks. And the last item I'm going to share with you is something from Target. And it just made me smile and I needed to have it. I even got one for my sister because she's into stuff like this as well. But here it is. <laughs> Do you guys see the rosy cheeks? And they put a little bit of uh, pink on the lips there. And as some of you probably will probably find this really ugly but I just thought it was so cute they had three different sizes small this is a small medium and large and then three different colors so this one a pink one and brown and I got this one I don't know I felt like it looked a little bit Asian if you look at it from a certain angle uh, but I, I mean I didn't get it just because of that I just thought it was so cute I love the polka dots and I'm gonna use this on my desk as a pen and pencil holder and that is it, my friends. You have made it, If you have made it to the end, I really appreciate it. And I hope you like this video. Um, and I hope you're doing well. I know the weather is going to start to get warmer, but please stay safe. Um, if you can get vaccinated, 
uh, please do so. I have done so and I just feel it just gives me a little bit of comfort knowing that I have that extra protection. I'm still washing my hands and wearing a mask and things like that and I hope you are too. And that's all she wrote. I'll talk to you soon. Bye. In typical Sam fashion, I forgot a few things. So I'm going to just share them with you really quickly. The first is this chain for your face mask. I just love the way that it shines and it just looks really pretty. I have a couple other ones, but they're starting to look like they've been worn a lot. So I decided to go with this one. And the cool thing about this is they give you for your eyeglasses as well. I don't think we're going to be wearing a mask forever. Um, but this is a good way to reuse the chain again. And then this is also another thing for for a face mask. You're supposed to put uh, the silver, the clasps onto the ear straps of your face mask. And then this will go behind your head and you could tighten or loosen as you please. Um, just sometimes for me, if a face mask has a toggle on it, it really hurts my ears. Um, so I thought this would make it a little bit easier. We'll see. I haven't used it yet. And then as I had mentioned, I've been doing gel nail using gel nail polish a lot. Uh, this is a Vina Lisa uh, gel polish and it's a beautiful baby pink opaque. The, probably the most opaque nail polish I've ever seen. It's really, really pretty if you're looking for a baby pink. And then this one is Mita Joe um, nail polish. It's the color Unicorn, I believe. And the best glitter nail polish. You could, with both of these, you could really get away with one layer. Um, I, did, I tried this one and I liked it so much. I got one for my sister and... She had gotten one for herself as well. It's just so beautiful. Uh, highly recommend.